A powerful earthquake with a magnitude of 7.3 struck near Port Vila, the capital of Vanuatu. The earthquake caused landslides, crushing cars and destroying many buildings. Among the damaged structures was a complex housing several Western embassies. The exact scale of the damage remains unclear due to widespread power and mobile network outages. Residents described the earthquake as the strongest felt in the past 20 years. The quake occurred on Tuesday at 12.47 p.m. local time. Emergency services are expected to be occupied for some time. Local officials noted, we have limited equipment and resources here. Several buildings in Port Vila have collapsed entirely. A large-scale rescue operation is underway to free people who may still be trapped. One resident said, we experience earthquakes often, but never like this. Giant cracks have appeared across homes and sliding glass doors were shattered. The resident added, we keep feeling aftershocks, each making us rush outside nervously. Vanuatu is a low-lying archipelago of about 80 islands in the South Pacific. It is located west of Fiji and is highly prone to seismic activity and natural disasters. (laughs) 
damaged buildings in the same complex included Diaz, UK, French and New Zealand embassies. As officials reported that their embassy building sustained significant damage. <laughs> the US embassy will remain closed until further notice, but all staff were safely evacuated. Several Australian airlines cancelled flights to Port Vila due to damage at the airport. The US Geological Survey recorded at least four aftershocks near Port Vila within two hours. These aftershocks ranged in magnitude from 4.7 to 5.5. Authorities in New Zealand and Australia confirmed there is no tsunami threat to their countries. <coughs> Australia stated that it is ready to support Vanuatu as damage assessments continue. Huh? New Zealand expressed deep concern and is closely monitoring the situation. <laughs>